Pardon me? What are we doing here? I don't remember anything before here, and now I suddenly am here, and I'm not sure why. Oh, that's simple. We're just waiting for the train to leave. What train? The Heavenly Express. It'll leave here soon from platform number one, and we will all want to be on it. Are you sure? Yeah, the conductor just made an announcement. Well, how don't we better get on board? Oh, please, go right ahead. Okay. Aren't you coming? Oh, sure, but it's not time for me just yet. I have a few things left to do first. Excuse me, is this the way to the Heavenly Express? Oh, yes ma'am, this is the way. Okay, let's see, do I have everything? Ah, yes, here's my ticket. Okay, goodbye. Goodbye, have a pleasant journey. Ticket? You didn't say I needed a ticket. Well, of course you need a ticket. Everyone needs a ticket. You can't ride on a train without a ticket. Well, how much are they? I'm not sure how much money I have. Oh, you can't buy them with money. Why not? Because they're free. Free? Ridiculous! I, I beg your pardon. Ridiculous. Anything that important can't be free. Well, they're free for us. Why? Well, basically, because we don't have anything good enough to pay for them with. Oh, what do you know? I have a gold-edged, platinum-plated, flame-resistant master card. Very impressive. I have a line of credit a mile long at a prestigious national bank. Mm-hmm. Congrats. Thank you. And believe me, if, any, if anyone can buy one of those tickets, I can. I'd like one ticket on, on the Heavenly Express, please. Money is no object, and I want to go first class. Oh, all the tickets on the Heavenly Express are first class, sir. What? No class distinction? Oh, no, sir. Do you mean to tell me that I would have to ride on the same train as... Do you mean to tell me that anyone can just get on this train? Yes, sir. Absolutely anyone. Young lady! Do you mean to tell me that I would have to ride on the same train as everyone else? Yes, sir. Well, I'm not interested. And if anyone can get on this train, it must not be a trip worth taking. And I probably wouldn't even like it once I arrived. I'm very sorry, sir. I hope you'll reconsider. NEVER! God is not willing that any should perish. Oh, what do you know? He didn't ask her how much. Like I already told you, they're free. Oh, well, what do you know? Ask her. Excuse me, how much are the tickets worth? They're priceless. Well, if they're priceless, how can just anyone afford them? With man, it is impossible. But with God, all things are possible. I think your ticket sales lady has issues. She's talking nonsense. <laughs> no, no, she's right. You'll see. Excuse me, is this the way of the Heavenly Express? Uh, yes, ma'am. Well, can you help me over there? I'm not as young as I look, you know. Yes, ma'am. You're not getting any younger standing here. Yes, ma'am. My heart's weak, my knees creak, my vision's lousy. I mean, look at me, I'm a mess. Yes, ma'am. Don't be smart with me. I'd like a ticket on the Heavenly Express, please. Of course, ma'am. And I'd like a section reserved for those of us who can't get around as quickly as others. In other words, I'd like to pre-board and be sure to have a wheelchair on there waiting for me when I arrive. I'm sorry, ma'am. There is no such reserved section, and we do not pre-board. What? No special reserved section? Don't you see how decrepit I am? Don't you feel sorry for me? Can't you feel my pain? But where you are going on the Heavenly Express, there will be no more pain or suffering or sorrow. There will be no illness and no death, and God himself will wipe away every tear from your eye. Listen here, little girl. I have spent my lifetime getting into this shape. No one's going to tell me that I have to give it all up just get on some stupid train. This is no ordinary train. Oh, what do you know? Jeez. Now that's sad. You, you ain't seen nothing yet. Look at these guys. Here we are, all together. Finally. Agnes, stand up straight. Dude, lay off. I don't understand her. Do you understand her? I've never understood her. Dude, it's like not that hard. Just try. Well, let's try to remember why we're here. We're here to meet the Heavenly Express. Do you have your ticket? 
Yeah, dude, I've got mine. Well, then let's get you on board. Wait, Dad, where's your ticket? Uh, I'm sure I have it here somewhere now. Get on board. Wait, but aren't you coming with me? Well, the idea of spending eternity with you, our relatives, and especially your mother is something I don't want to be a part of, so you're going alone. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. But, Dad, heaven's a totally radical and righteous place. You should totally go. Well, do you know, Agnes? What a pathetic display. Listen. Tell me how you get one of those tickets that boards you on a train that takes you to a place where there's no sadness, no sickness, and no death, and everyone's eternally joyous and happy. Okay, well, believe in Jesus, the Son of God, as your Savior and Lord. It is His righteousness, righteousness alone that can reserve your place on the train. It is His death on the cross that pays the price for your ticket. He is the way. I believe. Jesus, Son of God, I am a sinner. Nothing I can do and nothing I possess can buy my way into heaven. I thank you for what you did on the cross to pay for my sins and to reserve my place in heaven. In your name I pray. Amen. Amen. Welcome to your new life in Christ. Here's your ticket. Well, what do you know?